That was a pretty rough night. I had elk all night, and they're still going. I had one go around the perimeter of these trees that I'm in, like all the way around, and like circled all the way back around. Just bugling so loud and calling to ones in the distance. Oh my gosh. I just saw one bull elk cross the trail up ahead. I wonder if I'll see more up ahead. Two more elk just ran across the other way. Once again, another bog to walk through. My feet are cold and soaking wet with this awful mud. Well, there's some sticks on this one, but the sticks end and the mucky, squishy, waterlogged field. Just soaking my feet. What a way to start the morning. Taking a break here. There's definitely an elk over there, slowly coming closer. Maybe I'll see him if I stay really quiet. But he's definitely making some crashing noises over there. And then I hear other elk off in the distance. My left leg has been getting kind of itchy. And uh, that's the only part of my body, my skin, that I accidentally brushed against the poison oak. Fun times. It rained a little bit earlier and then it got sunny and bright again. But now a really big storm is rolling in. Some a lot of thunder and dark clouds in that direction. So I'll probably get some rain. Okay, and the flies are pretty bad right now. Pro tip, wear earbuds, even if you're not listening to music, and the flies won't go inside your ears. They've they've tried several times already, and I feel a lot better knowing that they aren't gonna climb into my ear and buzz around. I don't know what these things are, but they make me think of like corals. I'm gonna call them land coral. So I've been hearing about all the, the cool rocks in this section and they are not disappointing. This is gonna take forever. This is supposed to be a water trough for cows. I'm like sitting on the edge inside trying to fill this bag up. Uh, not really any good places to camp, so. I guess I'm just going to keep hiking into the dark. But, you know, at least there's no grizzlies here. I don't care about night hiking at this point. But, um, I won't be cowboy camping because uh, rain is potentially in the forecast. So, I don't want to deal with that in the middle of the night. <laughs> I mean, you can see the clouds up there. They don't look too friendly. I climbed up a little hill. The trail's down there and found a nice kind of flat area here and uh, there's less grass underneath this tree so I'll get a little bit more cover and potentially avoid condensation so and it's still just barely light out so I'd call that that worked out pretty good that's yeah damn I just got in my tent and it started raining what perfect timing.